it's time to talk about not letting things go and holding on way past where you should be in your life. And Zack Snyder has been doing the rounds, doing interviews in regards to Rebel Moon 2, which is somehow worse reviewed than Rebel Moon 1, which has got to be a feat of some sort of, it's some sort of Guinness World Book accomplishment, I'm sure. But um, he was asked about DC again, and if he's moved on, because in the last interview with the same outlet, he was like, oh, I'm done with that. I don't, I don't really care anymore. Well, he said he's got all the ideas. It's all in his head. And now he's willing to more or less concede and go back and do the Snyderverse in animated form. He just needs a good amount of money to do it. Where where does one even start with this? <laughs> I was enjoying the silence, goddammit. Yeah. Um, I mean. Yeah. Yeah. I, <laughs> I, I, <laughs> like, I, just don't, I just don't know what. There is, if your most diehard loyal fans have moved on and they're now on the rebel moon is dune and star wars what it should be train right and all this there's no room left for them or you in the dc universe that ship has sailed nobody has an affinity or connection for anything in that universe you can say cavill all you want but that's like the vocal cavill fans right the average person I've seen was like a DC fan. You ask them, they're like, yeah, I'm ready for a new DC. Like they didn't watch half of the new content that's come out in the last five years or more. It's, oh, I, what? Well, it's just, it, it, it's just sad at this point. <laughs> like, yeah. it's, he's, he's somehow outdone a, uh, on the, just the let, let go. He has, and it, it, no one wants it. You know, no one wants it, right? Just, just let it go. Just move on. And like we know, he signed Netflix signed him to a giant payday and a first look deal, and took Rebel Moon, and reportedly spent well over five hundred million dollars building that Oof. franchise. Like Oof. with the two films, an animated thing well, that might have been canceled, three, yeah, and a video game. That's we don't know what the status of it is. So with marketing, they're up there probably close to seven hundred million dollars invested, and it has not paid off. Like, no. um, well, I mean, it's, it's a good thing there's been no marketing for the second Rebel Moon movie. Yeah, because the only yeah. time he's mentioned Rebel Moon in the last week or so is talk about how the first one isn't the movie in the slightest and how the extended cut's going to be yeah. the movie, but apparently that movie yeah, like... is just filled with uh, like more sex and gore. Yeah. And like... that's the majority of the R-rated cut. So it's like, it's going to be the same thing, but like last week, I didn't even know when the second one was going to come out because no, they were advertising. They were, they were <laughs> advertising for... It was like they were advertising for the director's cut. And that's when the, ad for the second one came on. I was like, oh, okay. Anyway. It was actually an well, ad. Wow. I, yeah, I it was in like, yeah, the think, second one. Yeah, no, this is when I was like, just looked, I think I was looking on a uh, leaks form and they mm -hmm. showed the Rebel Moon stuff and then I watched it a little bit uh, after the fact uh, and then it said the second one was coming out. So, like, oh, okay. Guys, I, I just had a brain aneurysm because a brand new interview just dropped with the release. Oh, nice. Nice. They've completed the first four scripts, and this is a six film saga. Yeah, because I what? They, they said the other day <laughs> that they got plans for like five more, and I was like, is that five more oh. after the initial, like the, the initial three? So it makes eight, or is this five after the first one? This is going to end up being like 20 hours of pure dribble falling out of someone's Pretty much, behind. Yeah. Oh my God. How? Huh. This is completely weird because, like, like I, I assume that like, he has, like, you know, like some sort of plan. So just say we're gonna, we yeah, have plans yeah. for five more, and it's just like we're just gonna plug him in as we go. I mean, as we found out this week, most of his ideas come from actors. So, 
I can't believe he literally, I was like, yes, yeah. so I was talking to Leonardo <laughs> DiCaprio and he pitched Batman v Superman in Justice League. And I just said, oh, I'm going to use all that. Wait, what? <laughs> so part of me thinks that's illegal, right? Because it's not his idea then. <laughs> Isn't that what they always say? Don't don't give the directors so, or the writers any ideas because they can't actually use them. And so you never so see the it, complex no? confrontation of God versus the Justice League wasn't even the almighty Snyder's vision. And no, I, it came I, from a guy who can't date someone over 25. Amazing. This is... Yeah. 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 Wow. If it was anyone else other than Lee, I'd be like, it came from, you know, it came from that person. Uh-huh. Like, you can't say that because, you know, it's... everyone likes Leo apart from the whole 25 thing. So. Yeah. Oh, it's nice. It's kind of crazy. There's failing upwards and then there's somehow like spectacularly. Uh, mm-hmm. I just. Mm. Yeah. But then it, it would have been, it would be Netflix to go all in on Snyder and it would he sold them a false bill of goods that's literally what he sold everybody ever a false bill of goods you know like it's that scene from Dumb and Dumber with the IOUs it's like where's all the money well those are better than money those are IOUs (laughs) that sounds like look those rotten tomatoes they don't matter I'm making quality that's watched by 190 million people and then they're like actually that's just because we auto play the first three seconds sir (laughs) <laughs> oh yeah oh, it's, it's i'm gonna watch real moon part two i might leave it a week i might see just how the reaction Do it tomorrow is. it's 4 20. <laughs> no that, that will ruin my saturday <laughs> that would ruin my 4 20. i don't want to ruin a religious <laughs> experience yes. I, i'm ascending while watching rebel moon the only way to do it yeah, there we go no, I'm, I'm not letting snyder be my israel i'm not gonna ruin oh. religious celebration. <laughs> Uh, yeah oh man that is a that is a good segue to our next topic so i wish it was a guy i i, I, I regret yeah. actually saying that was horrendous but <laughs> no. well <laughs> free palestine i swear uh, I'm not, I'm not in agreed agreed so let's just jump into this 